Today we're going to take a look at some tips and tricks with using the bookmarks bar in Google Chrome. The first step is to make sure that you are using Google Chrome and that you're logged into your browser. You know you're logged into your browser when in the top right hand corner you see your icon and when you click that icon you should see that you are syncing to your correct Gmail account. The next step is to ensure that you are showing your bookmarks bar. Go to your three stack dots in Google Chrome, go down to bookmarks and make sure you have a check next to show bookmarks bar. While we're in this menu, let's go ahead and open up the bookmarks manager. That's directly under the show bookmarks bar. The bookmarks manager allows you to see all of your bookmarks in one place. You can also edit, delete, and move different bookmarks in the bookmarks manager. To create a new folder, use the three stack dots in that menu bar on bookmarks and click to add a new folder. You can also drop and drag different sites into different folders, rearrange folders, and edit using the three stack dots next to each folder or site. In addition to editing within the bookmarks manager site, you can also right click on any bookmark or folder in your bookmarks bar to make further changes to it. Creating folders is a great way to keep your bookmarks organized. I suggest creating folders for topics or units that you teach ahead of time. That way when resources come in, you can quickly put those resources into the folder and access them when you need them. You can also add folders to your bookmarks bar so that they display on your bar. I suggest having a current or a daily folder and keeping items in there that you are currently using. A quick tip is to right click on that folder and open all of the contents at once. Another tip is to edit the name of a website in order to easily identify it on your bookmarks bar. You'll notice that some of mine don't have any text next to them. To edit the text of a bookmark, go into the site you want to bookmark, click your star, and then edit the name. If you erase all the content and show it on your bookmarks bar, it will simply show the icon for that site. Don't forget, when you're logged into your at WSDR4.org account and showing your bookmarks bar, you'll be able to access the WSD bookmarks folder full of important places to our district.